Hello friends, Radhika Ravi Kumar here. In this tutorial, we'll see the if statements. So uh, you can uh, write the if statement in three ways. One is the if statement. So you can see here, uh, it's not like a PL SQL or any other um, you know C or Java kind of if. Whenever you write if, you need to end it with F I C. So this is what the one of the if statement is. The second one is if if uh, else if statement, okay. And the third type is the as we all know, it's a common one. Else if else statement, okay. So you can see uh, the the different types like uh, if and it ends with f i and the second one if starts with if then if else give a condition then it ends with f i again then the third type you can see if else if you don't put a e here whereas you just say e l s i f then the third condition will have just else and it ends with f i so these are the types of uh, if statements so now um, in each tutorial we'll see the few uh, one example for each uh, statement. So now let me start with the normal if statement. Okay. So coming to our Unix environment, here let me create a shell script. Okay. Here I'm going to say, uh, let me give a variable called a, I'll assign 10 to it, and another variable called b, and I'll assign 20 to it. So I'm going to start with the condition if then make sure that you are giving the square brackets here then inside the square brackets you are going to mention the condition I am going to give a condition where A is equal to B I am just checking whether these two are same if this is going to be same I am going to echo out something then just mention then and then say echo uh, echo out um, simply saying that uh, a is equal to b okay and uh, then you are going to finish it off or end it with f i as i said so make sure that you are giving then keyword here so i'm just checking whether these two are equal so let me uh, save this and run the script so nothing is getting displayed uh, because it's not equal right so if, uh, if I change it then uh, for example if I change this to like uh, I'll make this as a uh, 10 okay. then if I run the script again you can see the we are getting the output so this is the uh, one of the example of writing if statement so make sure that whenever you're writing uh, these if statement you give spaces as I'm telling from all my tutorial that the spaces are very much important in uh, when while you're writing scripts or else you'll be getting uh, unwanted errors and all so make sure that you're giving spaces uh, in as i've given it here and uh, in the next tutorial we'll see the next kind of uh, or next type of uh, if statements um, so please do like my uh, videos and also subscribe to my channel and uh, thank you very much for watching